Welcome to Mark's Gluten-Free Grocery Finds. Today, we are trying Cat's Powdered Donuts. Dairy-free, nut-free, soy-free, gluten-free. Serving suggestion. Thaw and serve. For best results, warm for a few seconds. Shoot. I gotta thaw them, guys. They're frozen. I gotta thaw them. So, I'll be, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. And we're back. I thawed my doni. I made some coffee to pair with my doni. Quick rewind. Beep, beep. Back up. What is Mark's gluten-free grocery finds? Whenever I find a product at a local store that is gluten-free and I have not had before, whether it be new or I just haven't seen it, I will try it out for you so that I can tell you whether it is worth your time and money to try it out. Quick story time. The other day, I went with my wife and mother-in-law to a local donut shop. They did not have gluten-free donuts, so I was not able to get any donuts. But as we walked out and I saw my wife carrying this box of donuts, it brought back this sentimental feeling, this, this like image in my head of when I was a kid and we would go to my dad's hometown and there was this amazing local donut shop and my dad would go out first thing in the morning before any of the kids were up and he would buy donuts, like a dozen donuts, bring them back. So when we all woke up, we had fresh, carefully made donuts ready to be eaten. And it just gave me this, like, it just made me really miss that feeling, you know, seeing just this image of, like, having a box of donuts from a place that isn't Dunkin' Donuts or Krispy Kreme. So it made me miss donuts, but then I kind of stopped thinking about it, and then I was at the store, and for the first time, I saw these gluten-free donuts. I don't know if this is a sign from God or a sign from the gluten-free universe, but I obviously had to get it. I mean, what choice do I have? And even more so, I was a powdered donut fiend. Like, that was my donut. I, I lived a life as a child. My childhood was defined by being covered in white powder. Don't, don't eat donut powder, donut powder. Nothing else. I was a, I was a good kid. Just a lot of donut powder all over me all the time. So here we are. Now, the key to Mark's gluten-free grocery finds is in order to prevent what I just did, this thing that I like to do where I kind of babble on about stuff that you don't care about and I just, I'm the only one who cares about it, I will put 90 seconds on the clock and I get 90 seconds to try this donut or whatever my future finds will be for the first time and give you my initial reaction and thoughts in 90 seconds, should you get it or not, let's go. So I thawed it, microwaved it for a few seconds. It feels nice and soft. I don't want to rush this. I know I said 90 seconds, but I don't want to rush it. I want to give you guys a, a true, a, a good, honest, you know, feedback. Am I covered in powder? Because I feel like I'm covered in powder. Okay. I'm ready to, to rate this. The flavor is spot on. Tastes exactly like a powdered donut. Exactly what I would expect. You know, 9 out of 10 on flavor? 10 out of 10 is almost impossible. So, 9 out of 10 is almost the best you can get. The texture is like, it's good. It's not as good as you would get from a, you know, gluten-filled donut. The texture just, it's the texture of a not super fresh donut, but it's not bad. When you think about gluten-free and stuff can be crumbly or dry, it's way better than what that baseline is a lot of the time. I give texture... Six and a half out of ten, and I say you should buy these donuts. I say as a gluten-free person, this is going to make you pretty happy to eat this donut when there are not very many donut options out there. So, Cat's Gluten-Free Donuts, you should get them.